I feel like I've got a career now, not just a job. Yeah. I feel like I've got a career. People that are our age, it because normally you think of apprenticeships for younger people, but mm. actually people our age that are a little bit more mature have had their families and now are realising how it how important it is to provide for your family. Yeah. It's a perfect thing to do, to go into Apprentice, get your training and then have a career. I'm Tracy Collins and I live on Tallinnmore and I'm 35 and I've got three beautiful children. They all came to the school, so I'm very proud of the school. Um, one of them at the moment, well two of them are still here and the oldest one, who's 14, goes to Lichick Minster and is doing amazingly there. She's school prefect. I also have a lovely husband and a dog, Pepsi. Uh, I trained, I didn't get much out of school when I was younger um, and then trained to be a hairdresser and then obviously had children, did a bit of bar work and then sort of looked after them because I was a full-time mum, so. Hi, my name's Melanie Lucas. I'm not married. I'm with a lovely partner, but I've been eight years. I have two lovely boys, one of 21, who's made me a grandparent three times. Mm -hmm. And I've got a little boy of five who's actually in the school at the moment. My oldest come to the school as well. I started off as a volunteer, so I started off just helping with mother and daughter netball, which then sort of ended up being, I'm taking the netball with a friend, and we did that every week, and the girls had lovely netball um, outfits that we made, and they did tournaments, and it was really lovely. I wanted to work in school but I didn't have confidence, I was young, didn't have any qualifications, left school with nothing because I wanted to be a hairdresser, a bit like Tracy, we didn't need qualifications, <laughs> no. we just wanted to go straight into an apprenticeship. Um, I think that's because we didn't do very well at school maybe, no. I don't know. I think I would have struggled going back into work if I hadn't have done the apprenticeship. I think mm -hmm. I would have really struggled Same. with the CV, with a job that fits around the children, mm -hmm. with education in general. When we first got the apprenticeship, I wanted to take on anything that could help me yeah. along in the apprenticeship. Yeah. So did you, Tracy, didn't you? Um, there was a lot of courses coming up and we thought, let's grab them, let's yeah. do this, you know. Yeah. It's going to make us um, more knowledgeable of what we're doing, let's do it. People seem to think that I'm a very confident person, but, but actually not. I'm no. really quite shy, not very confident, not very confident in my own skills. So I'm quite happy to talk to people and be really friendly, but not very confident in doing stuff and yeah. reading and writing maths and English that have been the most difficult thing and I find it still very challenging in the because I'm up in year six and I'm learning so much by them year six is the fractions the percentages yeah. um, English the grammar even though we're yeah. at college doing English and yeah. grammar it's helped me so much the help that I've received mm. on my course has been absolutely amazing I have a lady called Sarah who is with me on a Wednesday and she is brilliant. She works with me. She doesn't make me feel stupid. She doesn't make me feel like I've, oh, you've swapped those letter fans. How stupid could you be? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She just works with me and I feel like we're a team. I would just say, go with your heart, follow, follow your heart, go with what you want to do and you will find joy and happiness. I think it's a great way of getting back into work for people. Yeah that do want to work, that are willing in, are willing to put in the effort and time and maybe haven't got their GCSEs or maybe didn't do so well at school, it's an absolutely amazing opportunity for them to do because you are getting then your GCSEs and you're also working and showing that you are made of something because before I just thought I'm not, I'm just going to get, probably won't even get a job, do you know what I mean? Write my seat, uh, CV was difficult, everything just seemed too hard. And, and, then, and I think yeah. once you do it, it's so satisfying for yourself, for your children, yeah. for your family. It's just nice to, to, yeah. to feel like you've achieved a little something. I feel like I've got a career now, not just a job. Yeah. I feel like I've got a career. It's just brilliant. Really enjoying yeah. it. Yeah, really enjoying it.